Well, congratulations on finishing part one and having the nerve to go on to part two. Things get a little bit more complicated. They're not quite as simple in this, but it's you're going to end up with some of the greatest little gadgets in the world. You're going to love it. Uh, so the first thing we're going to do is add another tab on the top. It's going to be called Contact. And that's where someone can email you if they wish to. So just you, so you can see how absolutely easy it is. I'm right here at right and I chose page because we're going to actually make this a page and I'm just going to use the word contact instead of contact me because I want to keep this really short if it's possible. And I go right down here and it says page template and sure enough there's the contact. Now, the only other thing I want to do is on comments and pings. I do not want to allow comments and pings. Um, I think that for right now, I think we're going to leave it at that. And I'm going to start with here. Um, please contact me if you have any questions. Sally Olson. Oops, I didn't want that so far. I guess I'm stuck with it. Chicago, Illinois. I'd like to have that like not so far apart there. Don't you think it would look better? Well, we'll get to that because that's one of our exercises. Now you say, well, where's the contact form? Well, that's part of it here. We're going to save it. And you're going to find out right away once you save this that we go to preview this page and let's just see what it looks like click on the about not there not there so what is going on here well it hasn't been published and these are not going to be previewable i guess would be the correct word unless you publish it so let's publish it we can always take it off so i'm not going to worry about that now let's go up here and let's refresh and here is our contact page please contact me if you have any questions name email website and they have an anti-spam which means somebody can't come in here and send you a thousand emails by some machine somebody has to actually type in the number nine and a room for their message now wasn't that easy you've now added a new contact page congratulations